being able to sit out at a park with my baby and enjoy her and enjoy the park in these summer months and have a job that pays me okay where I can live life and enrolled in school this is all the things I have going on for me right now is just amazing among so many other things all done among so many other things like being able to enjoy small things in life with people who matter the most unmatched unmatched but just a thought There's still so much I'm trying to do to this bedroom. Like in this corner, I want to get something that sits flush on that back wall. So you're going to have a little bit more space in here because you know New York City apartments are very small. And I'm going to be living here for the next however long. I don't really know. So I have to make this space functional for myself. Um, what are we going to wear today? I'm trying to put her little outfit on. Her dad bought her two outfits the other day. They were the cutest thing. You hear me? Let's see if I can prop y'all up over here. She has a sports bra in her hand currently. These little house dresses have become the easiest thing for me to just jump into really quickly. And that's why I love them. Especially for hot months like this month and the foreseeable months. These little house dresses are what's going to do it for me every single time. So I want to put Mia in like a little outfit. I do have some dresses for her too that are so stunning. We could do this little purple number. I don't currently have like bloomers for her. I did recently make an order and I do have bloomers in there where you could just put underneath her little dresses. Otherwise, it's going to just be her diaper out, you know, so those are on the way. Oh, she has a cute little outfit that her dad bought. Also, we'll probably put that on. I think it's inside drying. Her dad bought this recently. He bought a Primark. I think I put on her once. So cute. So I'll probably put this on her today with these little pants. It is a little big for her, but that's okay because babies grow. So she will grow into it. So we have that. I'm gonna open that window to let some fresh air in, especially for those cooking. I like to air the place out. I see this organizer um, set of things. I'm not going to lie, it's kind of triggering my OCD because it's so clear you can see everything inside of it and everything just looks like a lot. But those are a lifesaver. So I'm trying to fix that corner. Where you guys are currently, I'm trying to get an IKEA. What is that system called? I can't even find my phone. That little skinny corner shelving that IKEA sells with like the little, you know, to put in that corner. I don't even know why, but you know, that's where we are. So we're going to get, we're going to, um, I don't know when that's going to be. I found on the Amazon for $90 or whatever. That's the same price it's on Ikea for. The dog on here actually looks like somebody hand drew it. And I think that's so cute about it. You put this little bow in your hair, honey. Beautiful girl. <laughs> what a beautiful girl. You're a beautiful little girl. Is that a beautiful lady? Yeah. That looks very cute. Now that she's able to see herself in the mirror and see stuff in her hair, whenever she sees the bowl, she is digging it out. She's digging it out right now. Anyway, so her hair. I'm going to find a pair of shorts to wear. I need to put some sunscreen on her, but also I need to put some sunscreen on myself because my coworkers keep telling me um, summer hasn't fully kicked in yet and I'm kind of dark. But like... It's because one of the days I put coconut oil on and I went outside and now we're here. But um, I'm going to bring my computer and stuff to the kitchen table. We're going to do a little bit of editing. I'm going to open this window here. You know, it is a good day. And we're going to take advantage. I haven't been outside in a minute. Today's not too, too hot. Mm. It's not that windy either. I feel a little bit of breeze, but it's not nothing too much. I feel like I'll be a little bit more productive at the kitchen table where I'm sitting up. Because if I sit in here, I'm going to be slouching, you know. Put away breakfast. This is why I love paper plates. Because I could just dump all of this in the trash. Hi, my love. Now that she can walk, she literally walks everywhere. Every room you go into, she's walking behind you. And I got that for her. Last week, she was a little bit more 
this week she's a little bit more stable her hands are still up but she's a little bit more stable and she can like hold something in both hands and walk so like we're meeting all the milestones cover this up I had two macadamia nut cookies last night um but I didn't even eat both of them I ate one So since I'm sitting here, I'm going to do some editing. I'm going to watch some YouTube videos. God, I need to buy a new SD card because now that when I left it in the side of my computer. Hi, honey, come here. She went back to the bedroom, but she also has the pear in her hand. Annoying her, her little butt might leave it in there. My plant that my friend bought at his job and gave me is dying and I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I'm so irritated. But also, that side shelf that I'm planning to get for my bedroom, I'm planning to put the plant in the living room that like drapes down on it yeah. so we have a little bit of greenery in my bedroom because they said it's really good to have greenery in your home. Okay. We wanna bring the greenery to the bedroom. We're gonna plug the phone in because I like leaving the apartment where my phone is nicely charged, especially because my walks are so long the longest possible hot girl walks i'm gonna wear the thinnest pair of leggings that i have because it is hot as balls outside hi so i need to be cool i'm gonna keep my hair in this little ponytail i think i'm gonna put my hat on to kind of shade my face a little bit so i might take it out but leave it in the braid take it out of the scrunchie we gotta go find the remote oh okay honey you want to watch the metro show and sit here and she's gonna watch her for as long as you put it on for she normally takes her morning nap around 10.30. Alexa, what time is it? The time is 9.04 a.m. So I have like 45 minutes to an hour to finish up the edits, find something that I want to wear, get her dress, get a bottle together, and go with her so she could fall asleep on the walk. What did you and Grandma do to this TV while it's not working? Honey, I don't know what you and your granny do to this TV while this shit is not playing. connected to this Manda are going on a hot girl walk yeah. hot because it's hot and yeah. get the ponytail out okay right now it's 10 32 we'll see what time we come back we didn't even get anywhere yet and she's already sleeping i had to stop and put her sunscreen on because i didn't think that that much sun would be catching her legs but her legs are catching a tan okay so i put a sunscreen on and the lady is already asleep okay we are not even 10 minutes into the walk yet but also i look like a glazed donut okay okay i also specifically scheduled her walk around her first nap time of the day because she's gonna sleep out the walk anyway and i want us to lay out on the picnic mat when we get there so right now she's sleeping and that's good because this is indeed her nap time hello guys welcome back to my channel you would be seen correctly we are indeed outside we have made it outside mia and i okay who would have thought we're laying on our little picnic mat oh she's eating my jacket you know but for the most part we're on our little picnic mat relaxing and having us a good little day today has been about two and a half or three weeks since we have been outside mainly because the weather was not great so now that it's great and the last two days it has been great but i just couldn't build up the momentum of the cloud side and i feel like you get that feeling when you haven't um worked out in a while and you want to get back into it but it's like you can't find the momentum because it's been so long and so the last two days i've been procrastinating but today i'm like yeah i'm gonna come home from work i'm gonna feed her breakfast and i'm gonna schedule this walk around her first nap of the day which we have successfully done she napped on the way here and so she's up and she's basically ready to explore. So now we're enjoying us a good little, you know, time outside here. We have snacks. We have her apple juice diluted with water. We have a little snack for me. I have water, everything that we need. It's really nice and cool because we found this beautiful little tree that we can rest under. And we are obviously in the shade this is great i walked for 56 minutes and eight seconds but also um 
I was running for some of it. Just the parts where the sidewalk is really nice and smooth. And that was so great. When I'm ready to leave, I'm gonna go around here, maybe a lap or two running, because I tried it before. Not the whole way though. And then we're gonna leave to go home. But for the most part, because we came so early, we have a lot of time to be out here for before like my mom has to come home or whatever. So I'm trying to enjoy it and enjoy it with memes. I also went and did her hair yesterday because, you know, I think when it's done um, like this, then I don't have to go in every day. The back is really nice and moisturized right now. So the curls, the little curls are popping. And sometimes it's not the best moisturizing. You don't see the curls. You guys, this would be me hours and hours and hours later since the last time I was on here. That walk was amazing. It was great. Everything that I needed. But you know what happened to me? I left the apartment early and it was still semi-cool. But what ended up happening is that I stayed out there for a while, about two hours. We were just laying out on the picnic mat. It was great. That's by the water. It's nice and cool. When we were coming back, it was hot. When I tell you that I felt like I had to stop every single block. There was a point where I contemplated just taking an Uber because I'm just like, I can't even, it's it too hot. I can't be bothered. I was giving me a water periodically because I'm like, I do not want this girl to overheat up in the sun. And all in all, I think this is not going to be conducive, especially not with her. Because when I'm fine on my own, she's, she's teeny tiny. In conclusion, I think when I go again, I cannot go as far as I went. I have to just do my laps and, and come home. Because going that far ain't it. When I tell you I came home, we showered and we've been sleeping for three hours. Out. We were beat out. You heard?